name is Connor Christopher, and I am a dual enrollment student at Valencia, taking an introduction to programming, and this is our final project. For my final project topic, I chose computer graphics. First off, computer graphics is just something that has always interest me, interested me, and I have always found it to be the future, especially with computers and how our world is surrounding ourselves with technology. So I, I thought that this would be a great topic to research and find more and learn more about the information of the fundamentals of the computer and the computer graphics. Computer graphics is the discipline of generating images with the aid of computers. Today, computer graphics is a core technology in digital photography, film, video games, cell phone, and computer displays, and many specialized applications. research paper just because of how many there are and finding one that was knowledgeable and credible. For my research paper, I chose The Fundamentals of Computer Graphics by Peter Shirley. He was a student at the University of Utah when he wrote this, and it was really in-depth, and I learned a lot about the basics, pretty much. It was great because I didn't honestly have a great idea of computer graphics, and it helped me, especially with wrapping my head around it and having a great sense of what it really does and the importance of computer graphics. <laughs> once I read this and once I found a research paper, it made it a lot easier to do my projects, so that was great. Some facts about computer graphics are to trick the eye and the brain into thinking they are seeing a smoothly moving object, the pictures should be drawn at around 12 frames per second or faster, and a frame is one complete image. Early digital computer animation was developed at Bell Telephone Laboratories in the 1960s by Edward E. Zajak, Frank W. Sinden, Kenneth C. Knowlton, and a Michael Knoll. Developmentals in CGI technologies are reported each year. An annual conference on computer graphics and interactive techniques. Some interesting details I found in my research source was that at one point in the book, it talked a lot about the perception of graphics and how much that has an effect on the computer user. I think that's a very cool thing because our eye plays so many tricks on us and allows us to see things in different perspectives. Some facts that I found were is the images, the image on the retina is upside down. The retina is front back inverted. The retina does not detect red and photoreceptors are suppressed by light. I mean, honestly, you don't have to really know much about computers, but I think those are very cool facts about the eye in general and how you perceive things about computer graphics. Computers have such a big role in our world today, and it's really important that people have knowledge about them and how they're built and the fundamentals of them. It says that 49% of 49.7% of house, households have access to a computer in 2019, and that's only a number that is growing. In conclusion, overall, computer graphics plays such a vital role in our world today. Without it, we probably would not be as, be as advanced as a nation as we are today. Many people see the computer and don't know the true fundamentals or what it makes to function. It's very interesting, it is a very interesting concept, and I suggest everyone should learn about it at some point in their life because it is going to be our future.